everyone in this session we will see write the c program to accept two matrices of order m by n and calculate addition of matrices so for this we consider the two matrices suppose 5 6 7 8 is your first matrix 1 2 3 1 is the second matrix so see this is simple to add this first matrix in the second but here we are doing this addition one by one so we need to add this 5 plus 1 so you will get the 6 here then 6 plus 1 2 6 plus 2 8 will be here 7 plus 3 10 will be here 8 plus 1 9 will be here so this is your resulting matrix okay Consider this as the first matrix A of two two, and this second one is B of two two. So you will get the result in the matrix. Consider this matrix as a C, the C of two two. Okay, and when we are accessing this element five, at that time write the A of zero zero means zero through zero column. Okay, plus add this element with the corresponding Same location means zero zero only. So B of zero zero. So you will get the one value. Store this value in the location C of zero zero. So you will get the six here. Okay, this is one six. In previous video only I explained how to accept all the elements, how to display the element, how to add or how to subtract the element, and how to display this result of this subtraction or result of the operation so let's see the coding for the thing here i have already written the program for this so for this you need to write the first two matrices here a is first then b take the c also okay and see your question is write a c program to accept two matrices or of order m by m So ask the values m and n. Okay, ask this value to user. So accept first matrix from the user of m by n size. Here we are uh, executing this program. This is a runtime execution. So at the runtime, user will enter the value of m and n. Suppose the consider the value of m and n is two. Okay, two by two or two by three. Then consider the two by three here. Okay, number of rows two, number of column three. Okay, so at that time scan the value, read the value from the user. So a matrix size will be depends on m by n. Suppose the two rows, two column, then four elements will be there in the first matrix. Then display the first matrix. Just display the matrix here. So here, print a person d. Give the some space to display the element. Then here is your element. Okay. Then again, accept the second matrix from the user. So uh, read the values, read the uh, m by n values from the user, and display these values here. Then for the addition, addition of two matrices, again you need to write this loop for loop for i equals to zero, i less than m, i plus plus for j equals to zero, j less than m, j plus plus, and then c of i j equals to f i j plus d of i. And display the sum. So let's execute this program. See, I will provide the previous program link in the description box. So you will get the detail of this program in previous program. Okay, previous video. Okay, in previous video I explained the each and every line. So please watch the previous video first. Subtraction of two matrices. Now we will run this program. Just click on a run. And see how many rows and columns in the matrix. Suppose the two rows and three columns. Okay, so how many elements you need? Six elements you need to enter for the first matrix. Suppose four, six, six, six. I am entering the same value, so you can easily see here. See this four, six, six, six. This is the first matrix. Suppose the second matrix element. I am considering the second matrix element now. We need to enter again six elements two 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 
coming in the same value. Okay, see, this is your second matrix element. The first matrix element is 4, 6, 6, 6. Then here 2, 2, 2. So you will get the output 6. First, 4 plus 2 is 6. Okay, 6 plus 2 is 8. Then 6 plus 2 is 8. So this is your addition. Okay, here we will add this element one by one with the same location. Means for the A of 0, 0 will be added into the B of 0, 0 only. So you will get the C of 0, 0 that is 6. So in this way you can do the addition of two matrices. And this is the coding. See, I am explaining the coding once again. First, accept the first matrix. Same coding you need to write here. Display the first matrix. Then again, accept the second matrix. Display the second matrix. Okay. And again, uh, you need to write the uh, coding for the addition. So, same coding here we are using. Just here you need to specify C of IJ equals to A of IJ plus B of IJ. See, this code is repeating. So, these lines Number of times, see, uh, uh, four to five times we are repeating the same code. Just keep it in mind. Just go through logic so you will, you can uh, easily write the program for the addition of two matrices. Thank you.